Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out on the beach without freezing. Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas time. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling or the windows in the rain is pouring. It will always be Christmas. Hello, guys, and welcome to my channel. My name is Deborah, and I hope and pray that you guys are having a fantastic day. Today is December the 1st. Yes, we are going into Christmas season. Yes, so excited. Thanksgiving has now passed. It is behind us. I did not want to move it so fast that I was taking down my Thanksgiving stuff before actually Thanksgiving was here and putting up my Christmas stuff. I love to live in the moment. And I just had so many things that I was so thankful for this Thanksgiving, so I did not want to rush anything. So I just took my time, guys. So like I said, today is December the 1st, and now I am actually putting up my Christmas stuff. So I'm actually in the process of getting ready to do my Christmas tablescape, my Christmas themed tablescape, if you have. Sorry if I look a little crazy. I have been downstairs digging out of stuff out of storage, looking for stuff in my kitchen, cleaning stuff, and I've just been like, just moving. So my bun is all messed up, so excuse the look. But however, nonetheless, I am in the process of doing this, so I thought I would bring you guys along for the joy ride, right? If you are new to my channel, hello and welcome to Simply Deborah. I hope you will become a part of our family and go ahead and hit that little red subscribe button right down below. And also hit that notification bell, and that way you will not miss any other uploads that I put up. And if you are returning, hello and welcome back. Thank you so much for coming back. I so greatly appreciate it. You guys know how much I love you. Love you to pieces. So guys, with all of that being said, I am going to go ahead and start on working on my um, tablescape. I have taken off um, my fall stuff. I still have the centerpiece that I'm going to be moving. And... I am just trying to figure out how to configure everything onto my table. As far as I don't want it to look busy, I do want it to look nice and elegant. So that is the thing that I am going for. I actually went in, if you saw my table theme last year, it would be similar to that. Probably won't be much um, that much difference to it. But however, I did want to I might change up one or two things. I don't know with my centerpiece. I can't find my runner. I think I'm gonna have to wait on my husband to come in. I've been looking in storage boxes downstairs and yeah, I can't find anything. So I did, however, find my napkin ring holders. I know these are so adorable, aren't they? And I found my table um, napkins. So I am gonna go ahead and put these on there. I think because I love the thing, so much with having the two odd ones for the green and then my um so i have a red charger for my regular plates i have this red charger behind it and then i have on my two ends i think i'm going to keep my green charger i will see some of the green is incorporated in it so I don't think it would look crazy. Let me just turn that around so you can see everything. So I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it this year.
guys, I completed. Um, actually, my husband came home. He brought me some dinner. So we ate. I completed my tablescape that I'll show you in a moment. But now we are getting ready to put up our Christmas tree. And then I'll get the Christmas tree. Um, I'm turning some light over here. It's kind of dark. Yeah, that's a little bit better. But last year I ordered a Christmas tree offline, which I've never in my life ordered a Christmas tree offline. But I can say I read a whole bunch of reviews on it. And once I got the Christmas tree, I was a little bit disappointed. But guys, once I put it up, well, first I read the reviews. They had great reviews. Once I got the Christmas tree, I looked at it and I was a bit disappointed and once we decorated it i have to tell you it was one of the best christmas trees i've ever have or had i got the christmas tree from king's king's christmas i believe that's the name of it looking at the box it actually came from kings of christmas and that christmas tree when i tell you guys it was so beautiful i cannot wait to me and my husband buy our new home and we have like the 10 foot ceilings and we can get the really, really big one. Oh my God, their Christmas trees. If you're looking to purchase a Christmas tree, my suggestion only, my review on it from last year, I absolutely love the Christmas tree. It was gorgeous. So hopefully we can get it. And it was, we had it filled with so much stuff on it. So it was just a beautiful Christmas tree. So if you're looking for a Christmas tree, I recommend Kings of Christmas and you will not be let down. Like I said, when I got it, it was a little bit, oh my God, what? And then once we put everything together, it just all came together. It was so beautiful. So I'm waiting on my husband and then we are going to go ahead and put it up and then I'll decorate it. And I have a few touches. I was bringing up stuff while he was um, at work today. So I have a little few things in the living room that I've already put in here but I'll show you everything once everything is completed so I'll be back I am gonna go and make me some chocolate chip cookies I want something sweet to eat so I'm gonna make me some chocolate chip cookies I'm gonna put my Christmas music on and we are gonna get this Christmas tree up so I'll talk to you guys in a moment
Okay guys, I know I am looking a complete mess. Yes, you don't have to tell me in the comments down below that your girl is looking a mess, but I did wanna come on to show you all that I have finished decorating everything. My husband and I, we put up the Christmas tree. I did my tablescape. So before I close out this video, I wanted to go ahead and show you guys everything that I have completed. So this is all you will see of me. And if you are new, again, hello and welcome to my channel. I hope you will become a part of the family and go ahead and hit that little red subscribe button right down below. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell. And if you are returning, hello and welcome back. Thank you so much for coming back. I so greatly appreciate it. Let me turn this TV off because I'm really not watching it. It was just on. There. Okay guys, so I guess I'll start with my Christmas tree. So here is, <coughs> excuse me, my Christmas tree and there are so many ornaments on it. I think like every branch has an ornament on it. So I have some reindeers that will be guarding it and I have some pictures of my grandchildren. I have one of my daughter and I'm still missing two and I have one of Bella and one of little Dio and I will be putting Che picture right there or either Lanaya's and I have another one right here that one of their pictures will go in. So the tree is really really decorated with a lot of weird things on it it has christmas tree on top of a christmas tree we have santa claus outfit we have mailbox we have joy we have a little bit of everything all of these ornaments were brought last year. I did not go out and buy anything this year. So we actually used everything that we had. Hmm. I was trying to find some more little things. We have another outfit. We have a little squirrel here. This one is so means so much to me because my husband used to call my daughter squirrel. And so I absolutely love that one because it reminds me of her. And we have a reindeer right there. We have a quite a bit of ornaments, but yeah. So we have one gift under the tree already right there. Won't tell anybody whose it is yet. And then I have over here in this corner, we have our little house with just a little joy. We have the Christmas Boutique along with the home. We have the Christmas trees out there. This one is the elementary school and they're doing a toy drive there today. So they've been quite busy. Then I have my Noel sign. I have my Countdown to Christmas that I will be putting my Christmas tree in every day and it will tell me how many more days we have for Christmas. So today is the first. So that one is in there. And then guys, moving over here in this little corner, we have Santa mailbox, which my grandchildren usually fill out a list and put it in here. There's nothing in there right now. So they have to make out their Christmas list then we actually have some presents. Merry Christmas. And we have the Christmas bag with a couple of presents sticking out of it. And then I have the lantern. And the lantern just has a little red car with, again, some Christmas trees. That I actually DIY'd that project last year. And then in this corner, we have the Rudolph, I mean the reindeers, which is Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen and Rudolph. So that is what we have there. And then on my fireplace, we have Noel, this pretty little sign that I picked up 
a couple of years ago from um, Orlando. And then we have just this little um, greenery with like fake snow on it. So I guess you can kind of call it some type of garland. I don't know what it is, what type of garland. And then we have just these two little white things that are just sticking out the end of it. And then I have my two stockings, one for my husband and one for me. So, and then I have the joy sign right here. And guys, this is all I have for my living room. So I think it all came together really, really nice. I'm really loving it. I have my, which they're not lit. Maybe tomorrow I actually have to buy another, um, what is that called? Not an outlet box, but I need to buy me another track with the outlets in it so that I have enough wire or enough um, outlets to plug those up to it. So I have one of these on each side and then I have a snowman in the middle which you probably can't see the snowman but it's right there so that is what I have for my living room so now guys we will move to my oh I look a mess we will move to my kitchen I just wanted to turn off these lights in here I do have Rudolph, where some people have a little elf sitting on shelves. I have my Rudolph sitting on my shelf. And he's watching my home when I'm not here. And he's keeping an eye out for things. And then guys, my battery is getting ready to die. But hopefully I can do this before my battery dies out. So, um, over here in my kitchen, the only thing I really have over here is a little wreath over my sink. And then I have, I don't have anything else over there. And then on my tablescape, I have my beautiful napkin ring holders, which I don't have anything in it. I am going to go to Pier 1 and see what I can find to go in there. I didn't want to put my napkin ring through it. I like the way that I have my napkin set up with my red charger. And then I have my, these are bells that I think it matches my centerpiece really well. So this is what I have for the four sets, one across and that way. And then on the end, I kept my green chargers and I thought that was cute because green is for Christmas too, right? And then for my runner, I have this beautiful, which I actually had last year. So I have this beautiful runner, which I, it was almost like my fall runner. It reminds me a little bit of it, but I thought it was so adorable and I loved it. So I brought it back this year. Why buy a new one when the old one works? And then I have my two candle holders with my candles in it. And these are just little decorations that I brought from Michael's last year and I just put it around my candles. I actually picked this up from Michael's last year. Or no, I got this from Pier 1. And this matches my ring holders. So I thought that was really cute with the little um, uh, pine cones. So I really, really like that. But again, this is my table, guys. Nothing fancy dancy. And then in this corner, I have my, I have to buy some Christmas candy and fill my bowls up. But I have my little snowman that I actually picked up from Kohl's. Kohl's have some really, really nice things and really good deals. So if you haven't checked out Kohl's, you probably should. And then I picked this up from Michael's. It's just a little red card with the Christmas tree. I have my sleigh, which I picked up from Michael's. And this is actually a chalkboard that you could write notes on it. And then I have my cookie sheet or my cookie plate. And it just reads, Dear Santa, I have been very whatever this year. 
please bring me and then I'll fill it in at the bottom. P.S. These cookies are for you. Guys, I always, always, always make cookies for Christmas for Santa. So, and he does visit my home and he does enjoy the cookies very much. So now we are moving into my office, guys. And in my office, I just have that little joy sign there and it lights up when I um, plug it in. And then I have a wreath. I have the word believe. All of this was actually from last year. I have my hat over there. And then in here, I have my two stockings for my daughter and my husband. And then again, in my office, we will count down the season. And this should be on one. And this is just a little magnet and it just sticks on. So that is really beautiful, I love. And then I really, really love this. And I'll tell you why I love it. It is my garland again. And on this one, it has my reindeers. So it has three reindeers. It have the mommy, the daddy, and the baby. And I love it. They always are marching. They're always looking for food. They're always eating the garland. So, they so that is what I have for my Christmas theme for my home this year. I hope you guys have enjoyed it as much as I have enjoyed putting everything together. I will come back. I have some more videos that will be coming up this week. I'm so excited about those. And now I am going to go ahead and close out this video for I can get ready to take a bath and go to bed and wake up in the morning and do it all over again. Yeah. So I guess I will talk to you all in my next one. Until then, love, peace, and happiness. Always, 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 always do something good for yourself. Guys, I am not doing shout out Monday tomorrow, which you will see. So I had to change up my battery. But um, I unfortunately, I will not be doing shout out Monday today because of the holiday that have passed. My daughter was here. I just been super, super duper busy trying to do things with her. And so, yeah, so I have not had a chance to really do anything as far as upload any videos, do any videos. I just been trying to show or just been trying to have that um, just a long time, yeah, with my family. So, unfortunately, the camera was not picked up and I have not been doing anything on YouTube. So, I will not be doing Shout Out Monday this week, but next Monday, which will be the... Uh, the uh, next Monday, I think it's the 8th. I think it's the 8th. I will be back next Monday with my shout out Monday. If you would like to be shouted out, go ahead and put hashtag shout me out and you may be selected to be shouted out come next Monday. And I think that is it. I think I covered pretty much everything. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and go now and I will talk to you all in my next video. Until then, love, peace, and happiness. And I'll talk to you in my next one. Kisses for everybody. Thank you so much for all the new subscribers. I so totally appreciate it. I'm just tired, guys. So I've been super duper busy. Been up at the crack of dawn this morning. Get, went to church. Came home. Started on my Christmas stuff. And that pretty much took the whole evening. So, yeah, so I am going to go ahead and take me a hot bath, relax my back, relax my muscles, and I will talk to you all in my next video. And I'll chat with you later. Bye-bye.